Hey guys, in this video, what we're going to do is just some more basic indefinite integrals that in just involve some one term function of x. I want to do this just to make sure that some of the key concepts we pointed out in the video prior to this made sense to y'all and that you guys are definitely comfortable with what we're doing. So the first one we're going to take a look at is the indefinite integral of 3x squared dx. So again, the first thing we're going to want to do with this is just factor out our constant multiple 3 outside of our integration, which will in turn just leave us x squared dx inside of our integral. Exact same thing we did in the last video, but we're just going to get a little more comfortable with it this time around. So now we're ready to integrate it. So again, when you go to integrate this, we see that the power on our x is 2. So what we're going to want to do is increase that power by 1 and then take that power and divide the entire thing by the power. So long story sh short, what this will leave us with is 3 times x to the second power plus 1 divided by 2 plus 1 and then again plus our constant of integration c. So after we clean this up a little bit, what you'll see is that we'll be left with 3 x to the third power divided by 3 plus c. Again, what you can do here is notice that since we have a 3 in the numerator and also a 3 in the denominator, we can go ahead and cancel them out, which will leave us x cubed plus c. And remember, all of that is going to be our antiderivative, which we notate as capital F x squared equals x cubed plus c. Again, if you're a little unsure about how you did that, you think you might have made an error somewhere, you can always just differentiate it once. And if you generate the same function that you were trying to integrate originally, then you know you've done it right. Thanks for watching. If you need more help, visit our YouTube page at youtube slash user slash fredjucate or visit fredjucate.com for more helpful videos.